one is me again, Mom says. So, in this video, this is the part 3 of our um, solving stoichiometry problems. So, sample problem number 5. The given problem is zinc is a silvery metal that is used in making base with copper and in plating iron to prevent corrosion. So, how many grams of zinc are in 3 uh, 0 0.356 mole of zinc? So, this sample problem number 5 is a mole, mole to mass stoic problem. Bakit? Kasi you have here the given mole and then target mo is grams which is mass. Okay? So, paano natin ito isasolve? Mole of zinc. So, the given mole of zinc. Okay. 2 mass of zinc. Okay. So, given mole times molar mass of zinc. Okay. So, the molar mass of zinc is 65.38 grams. So, we just multiply it to the given mole. Okay? So, we have 0 0.356 mole of zinc times the molar mass. So, we have here grams, then below yung mole. So, 65.38 grams of zinc over 1 mole of zinc. Okay? So, don't forget to cancel the unit. Okay, so cancel the unit mole. So, natira is grams. Ayun yung target natin, no? Grams, di ba? So, if we calculate this, 0 0.356 times 65.38 over 1. So, we will have 23.3 grams of zinc. Okay, so, ibig sabihin niya, there are 23.3 grams of zinc in 0 0.356 mole of given zinc. So, this is a mole to mass problem. Okay, let's have sample problem number 6. Sulfur is a non-metallic element that is present in coal. So, when coal is burned, sulfur is converted to sulfur dioxide and eventually to sulfuric acid that gives rise to the acid rain phenomenon. So, how many atoms are in 16.3 grams of sulfur. So, the given is mass of sulfur and we are looking for the number of atoms. So, we're using the Avogadro's number. We're in for every 1 mole merong 6.022 times 10 to 23 particles. So, ang particle na given natin dyan ay atoms. Uh, Okay, ayun o, atoms. So, paano, ta paano natin i-compute ito? So, madali lang. So, grams of sulfur. Ayan, times or 2 moles of sulfur. 2 number of atoms. Okay. So, calculate natin yan. Ayan. So, 16.3 grams of sulfur times, okay, so molar mass ng sulfur, which is 32.07 grams. So, 1 mole of sulfur over 32.07 grams of sulfur times the number of atoms. So, we have 6.022 times 10 to 23rd power atom over 1 mole. Okay? So, don't forget to cancel the unit. So, we have here grams then mole. Okay? So, our answer here is 3.06 times 10 23 atoms. Okay, so this is the answer. So, kapag naka-encounter kayo ng ganitong problem, you use the Avogadro's number.
Agitin ang tatandaan tong 6.022 times 10 to 23rd power. Okay? For every 1 mole. Okay? That's it for sample number 6. So, I hope may natutunan kayo dito sa stoichiometry problems natin, 5 and 6. Thank you for listening. God bless us all.